Shonen anime and manga sucks and it's for immature losers. Fact. This is not an opinionated video. People who are too casual, too moronic to experience anything deeper than fights and power-ups. Oh, but come on, young. Come on, young. I mean, like, come on. I, I want to know who's stronger, man. I, I, I want to see some action. I want to see another form. He has another form that he's going to change into. I want to see the main character persevere. Come on. It's just sad. Shonen fans are losers. They have ruined anime, ruined manga, and continue to embarrass themselves on a daily basis. So I decided, you know what? Why not make a video going over the top 10 worst shonen of all time? I honestly could have made this a top 50 or so considering how many garbage shonen actually exist, but I decided to limit it to 10. That way I wouldn't be here all day. Most shonen are absolute garbage, but these are the 10 worst of the worst. The worst shown unimaginable so if you like any of the series mentioned here just know you're not a real anime or manga fan please abandon the medium immediately and stop ruining it for real anime and manga fans such as myself so without wasting any more time let's get into it all right so we're gonna kick this list off with black clover i don't know how this boring generic naruto ripoff hasn't been canceled yet it makes no sense. I mean, out of all the series that deserve to be canceled, out of all the series that deserve to just get on up out of here, Black Clover is one of the most deserving of all time. From the generic story to the cliche characters, the boring fights with no strategy, everything about Black Clover is extremely garbage and just screams this is something that was made for idiots. What type of creator, honestly, writes something like this and expects to be taken seriously? Like, there's no way. Like, how do you, as an adult, write something like this and say, okay, Okay, this is something of quality. This is something that's going to resonate with people. I, I don't get it, but I guess, you know, it worked out right because it's still popular. Uh, it's probably only still popular because of the fan service. You know, as long as you draw titties over and over again, uh, the losers will flock to your series immediately. But if I was a Black Clover fan, I wouldn't even admit it. I'd just be like, yeah, I like it on the low. I, I wouldn't admit it because admitting to liking this trash is just admitting that you're someone with bad taste that is not a real anime fan, someone that can't be taken seriously, and quite frankly, someone that just smells like butt. Uh, but yeah, Black Clover's trash. Next up is Attack on Titan. Attack on Titan is a plot hole infested piece of trash that only losers with bad taste actually enjoy. If there's one series that just screams only casuals with bad taste enjoy this, it's Attack on Titan. There is no way anyone who has an inch of good taste could ever stomach Attack on Titan. It just would never happen. And Attack on Titan fans just cannot be taken seriously in the slightest. They have horrible taste. They've never read a seinen before. They're just shown in tards. It's scary, honestly, how bad their taste really is. This series has a terrible wannabe deep story like it went from just random monsters eating people then it tried to get overly political and just embarrassed itself like oh my gosh the author of this series doesn't know how to write at all if this is good writing to again people that have never read an actual book before people that have never uh read a complex manga you would think attack on titan has good writing but someone like me that basically experiences greatness on the regular someone that is truly intellectual can see how bad this writing actually is but attack on titan fans don't care about quality just care about who gets eaten and a bunch of other irrelevant characters but terrible story terrible characters that get no development um terrible art in the manga bad animation and art in the anime again if you're a fan of attack on titan you're an idiot i'm so glad this trash is ending soon it doesn't deserve to be here it didn't deserve to last this long and no one no one no one will be talking about attack on titan after it ends mark my words it will fade into irrelevance just like it did before that garbage anime came and saved it and Imagine, imagine needing an anime to save your dying manga. Without the Attack on Titan anime, it would have been canceled a long time ago. Yikes. Next up is Boruto. The original Naruto was complete garbage already and I didn't think it could get any worse than that until Boruto came out. This series is only enjoyed by people with half a brain, let's be honest. No one with a fully functioning brain could actually like Boruto. It's a bland predictable story that's even worse than Naruto's story. Characters that are even worse than Naruto's characters. Characters that are even more useless than Sakura. I didn't know that was possible. Uh, bad art. Imagine liking Boruto and thinking you're a normal human being. Oh, but come on, young. Come on, man. I mean, like, come Come on, yeah, it was trash at first, man, but now it's good after X chapters. <laughs> Imagine, imagine reading or watching something that needed chapters upon chapters, episodes upon episodes just to get good. That could never be me. If it's not good from the start, then it just was never good to begin with. 
Next up is My Hero Academia, a boring X-Men and Naruto ripoff that fails in every single category. Like imagine being so unoriginal you make a manga about superheroes, the author of the series has no talent at all, he saw how popular superhero movies were with the Marvel trash and stuff like that and thought, hey maybe I can cash in on that and make a manga about superheroes and it just failed. All the popularity is just due to it being a bunch of losers and casuals with bad taste that hype up everything. It's not that it's actual quality. No, they don't hype up quality. They hype up garbage. Bottom of the barrel garbage. And that's what My Hero Academia is. He wanted a piece of the pie and just created trash. Deku is one of the worst protagonists of all time. Fact, not an opinion. And the side characters are a complete joke. The story is just so stupid. They try to create this fake underdog, but he has everything handed to him. It's just such a joke. How can this generic, cliche garbage be acceptable? How could you like this and honestly expect to be taken seriously? I don't know. You people just have terrible taste and this is just laughable. Next up is Jujutsu Kaisen. Jujutsu Kaisen is a bad bleach ripoff that only losers with bad taste enjoy. Like who in their right mind creates a series, starts to write everything down and says, out of all the trash out there, I'm going to take inspiration. No, not inspiration. I'm going to completely rip off Bleach. Bleach, out of everything you could have chosen, you choose to rip off Bleach. Bleach is so trash that even its own fans forgot about it for years. If it wasn't for the announcement of that trash anime that's going to be coming out, nobody would even be talking about Bleach. So this is the trash that you choose to build your series around? Pathetic! I couldn't, <laughs> I couldn't imagine being that pathetic. Jujutsu Kaisen is literally nothing but a ripoff of Bleach. Nothing original about it. Cookie cutter characters, cookie cutter story, just everything about it is so cookie cutter and generic and yet it is praised. Not because it's actual quality, but praised because it's just another garbage shonen. As long as you come out with another shonen and do the same exact thing as five or ten other shonen, you're praised for no reason. This trash series does not deserve the praise or the hype. It's just another bottom of the barrel trash shonen. Next up is Demon Slayer. Demon Slayer only got popular just like Attack on Titan because it got an anime. No one knew about it. No one cared about Demon Slayer before the anime. You couldn't find a single soul talking about it before the anime. Then the anime comes out and boom, all of a sudden these casuals want to act like it's so good, it's so enjoyable. Then the anime ends and the series goes right back to being completely irrelevant. Everybody forgot Demon Slayer even existed. Nobody talks about it anymore. No one hypes it up anymore. It's just another trash series <laughs> horrible horrible series generic story that's been done thousands of times characters that are so tropey they're just cardboard cutouts fights that are completely boring and lack originality i'm so glad that this trash ended they came out with that movie and the movie was supposedly breaking records and doing all of these numbers and it's like yeah because that trash anime got it popularity that it didn't deserve if it went strictly off of the manga nobody would be talking about this series no one would know about it because it was trash that's what i'm saying these anime they give attention to these garbage manga that don't deserve it we have so many more deserving manga that will never get adaptations but yet trash like this gets it why because casual garbage like this sells it brings in the casual morons with bad taste which means more popularity sad Next up is Haikyuu. I am so glad this garbage ended already. How some trash series about a group of boys playing volleyball got popular in the first place is just beyond me. This anime, this manga is an embarrassment. Sports does not belong in anime or manga. The only people who like sports, anime, or manga are losers that are not capable of playing sports in real life, so they have to live vicariously through sports, anime, or manga. It's just sad. This series has a terrible story, bland characters, the games are not good, they win every match that they play, there is no tension, there is no suspense, you know they're going to win, like how is this fun? I would give it that if it has some suspense where oh he's coming down to the wire you don't know who's going to win, you know who's going to win before the game even starts it's so predictable I don't understand how anyone can say with a straight face I'm a fan of Haikyuu, this is one of my favorite series, yikes, stay away from me, never come around me, if anyone around me said they liked Haikyuu, I, would dis I, would I wouldn't even associate with them, they're, they're just frauds.
Next up is Bleach. It's hilarious how irrelevant Bleach is. It, it's so funny. A lot of people used to say, part of the big three. The big three is a part of the big three. And now look at it. <laughs> No one cares. No one cares about Bleach. If it wasn't for that anime, if it wasn't for that new anime that's going to be coming out, that's going to be finishing the trash manga, which I don't understand why. Why would you bring the Bleach anime back? It was trash um, before, and it's just going to be even more trash now. But you got some diehard fans out there that pretend like this garbage is actually good, pretend that they like Bleach, but no one actually cares about Bleach. It's always been trash. A boring main character who gets infinite power-ups left and right just because a completely irrelevant side cast that does absolutely nothing fights as boring and dull as the main character himself bad art in the manga bad animation in the anime bad music there is a reason why this manga got canceled kubo is a complete fraud he doesn't know how to write anything he just wants to draw stuff he wants to draw stuff and just the story and everything else is just backseat it, it just takes a backseat to the drawing that he wants to do it's like go do something no, be an illustrator then. Stop trying to create series. Just go draw from somebody for somebody else. Don't try to draw your own stuff, make your own stuff, because it's trash. That's why Kubo will never have another series. That burned the witch, where did it go? Nowhere flop. Next up is One Piece, or should I say One Piece? This is something that should have ended long ago. How they have been able to milk this garbage for so long is honestly crazy. Every arc is the same exact thing sell to an island and beat people up people never change and this anime and manga never change the anime is even worse than the manga the manga is trash itself but the anime is even worse i mean it, nobody dies in this anime it, it's just plot armor and ass pulls left and right the characters are all one dimensional have no progression no development the fights are so bad it's laughable they win due to just plot armor the power system is lame eat a fruit gain a power come on a two-year-old made this absolutely embarrassing series the fact that this trash has over a thousand chapters now when is this garbage going to end it doesn't deserve to be here I, I can't take anyone seriously that likes One Piece. And what's worse are people think they're actually cool. People think that they have good taste for liking One Piece. One Piece is one of the worst series ever created. And I'm not even talking about anime. I'm not even just talking about manga. It's one of the worst pieces of garbage to ever exist, period. It's that trash. Next up is Naruto. Naruto is the epitome of garbage. If you're a Naruto fan, you are such a loser and a fraud. Naruto is one of those series that if you like it, you have no right, no right to call yourself an anime or manga fan. Imagine liking something that blatantly ripped off something better. Naruto is a bad Hunter Hunter ripoff. Kishimoto saw how goaded Togashi was and tried to copy him. There's a reason why people say Naruto Part 1 was good and then Shippuden was bad. They try to damage control like, yeah, well, Shippuden sucks, but N Naruto Part 1 was was actually good well yeah because he was blatantly ripping off hunter hunter in naruto part one and when he ran out of material to rip off and had to come up with his own ideas aka shippuden it quickly showed how much of a fraud kishimoto actually is <laughs> imagine liking naruto that can never be me i'd rather piss glass all right, so there you have the top 10 worst shonen of all time. Man, shonen is trash. I don't understand how anybody could uh, read a shonen manga or watch a shonen anime. It's just not quality. There's nothing quality about shonen. Of course, you have a few exceptions, but for the most part, shonen is just bottom of the barrel garbage.